Right now at prime time, why one woman's disability is helping to spread awareness for accessibility in downtown Charleston. And we are continuing to give you the first alert to a couple of showers and storms moving away from the coastline. But how about our rain chances for the weekend of your full first alert forecast coming up? And hundreds of palmetto trees saved from destruction thanks to community efforts. Life I've used at 7 o'clock starts right now. Now, from the Low Country's news leader, this is Live 5 News. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us. I'm Michael Higdon. A disability advocate is at odds with the accessibility accommodations here in the Low Country, especially in downtown Charleston. Jane Mattingly, who is disabled, went viral for an Instagram reel she posted when she says she was not welcome to a few of the shops on King Street. Our Caroline Spike sat down with Mattingly to hear her experience and why she felt that way. Michael, we know Charleston is a historical city, which can mean histor historical and sometimes outdated buildings. But Madeline says that is no excuse for the lack of accessibility. 